so recently the circuit breaker has been extended and I'm not sure whether some of you are craving for the food that you can't really get outside even the delivery Me myself actually craving for a cream puff so badly uh, yeah and I thought like why not I just challenge myself to make it on my own I know cream puff is quite complicated but what is called a challenge if it's not challenging right and in case you are new to my channel, um, I'm Miss Potato and I'm uploading a video every once a week. So if you like my video, please remember to hit on the subscribe button and click on the notification button so you won't miss out my new videos. So without further ado, let's get started! Here, I'm going to show you a few mistakes that I've made. The first one is for the crust. The one on the right hand side, the butter was left outside for too long and thus it got softened and when it mixed with the flour, it's actually very sticky and hard to mold. Whereas the one on the left side, I took the butter directly out of the fridge and you can see it's quite crumbly and hard and it's easier to manage. crucial part is during the process of making custard cream. So as you can see here, I will need to keep stirring it while mixing and then we have to keep an eye on it. Once it is thickened, you might need to slowly lower down the heat and turn it off because the remaining heat will also help with the thickening of the cream. It is important to keep the butter and milk mixture boiling hot because later when you add in the flour, it will actually activate the flour and create a fluffy light and with a central pocket in the puff. Those who are staying in a humid weather like me, this step you will need to do it really quickly or else the butter crust will get softened and it's really hard to manage. But don't worry, if it gets too softened, just pop it back into the fridge and it will get hardened.
Today I nailed the challenge. Let's start feasting in. I wanted to try on whether the crust is crispy and is fluffy enough in the inside. Let's eat. See the texture. really crispy because of the crust on top and the cream inside the custard inside is delicious <coughs> it's really yummy I'm really proud of myself so shameless right anyways so if you would like to recreate some cream puffs and yep i hope this video will help you in order to avoid all the mistakes that i've made and i'll see you next time bye